In this lesson, we shall be solving this word problem in front of us. There are 40 pigs and chickens in a farmyard. Joseph counted 100 legs in all. How many pigs and how many chickens are there? And we solve this particular word problem step by step as follows. We let x be equal to the number number of pigs like so y becomes the number okay the number of chickens um like so and then now there are 40 meaning that the sum of the number of the pigs and the chickens is actually 40 like so and the implication out of these is therefore that y equals minus x plus 40. Let us call this here the first algebraic equation. Right, but we know that Joseph counted 100 legs in all, so that in the end, then we know that one pig has four legs. Right, we're looking at normal pigs here, and a chicken has two legs under normal circumstances, right? So that the total number of the legs is 100. So that we are saying, if one pig and pig is X has four legs, then we have four times X. And uh, a chicken has two legs, then we have two times the number of the chickens. And therefore, this will give us the number of the legs. And therefore, it means that we have uh, we've written 4x plus twice y equals 100. And we proceed to multiply by one half both sides, like this. And therefore, if we multiply by one half both sides, you have this here. And then, what is this? Okay. And then now we have exactly this equation here. Let us call this the second algebraic equation. And we proceed to say put one into two. Let us put equation one into equation two. And equation one is y equals minus x plus 40. So we have two x plus and y equals minus x plus 40. Right, which is equal to 50. And we have 2x minus x, which is exactly x. Right, and x now is equal to 50 minus 40. What is 50 minus 40? It is actually 10. Right. Hence, it follows that we know that y is uh, minus x plus 40. And this means y equals minus 10 plus 40. So that y equals 30. Right. And if this is the case, we continue to say thus. Right. They are x equals x equals 10. Right, because we know that x is what? x is 10. So the x equals 10 pigs. Because x represents the number of pigs. And, uh, and y equals, we got y to be 30 chickens. Okay, like so. Now, what is this now? What do we do with this? So we check the solutions. We conduct a quick check of the solutions. So how do we check the solutions? To check the solutions, we know that x plus y must be equal to 40. Right. So we have x plus y. We got x to be 10, and y was obtained as 30, and 10 plus 30 is a 40. And hooray, and this is correct. Eureka. Right. So, Eureka, we have 
got this here. Okay, next, we know that one pig has four legs and a chicken has two legs. So that four into X, which is 10 plus two into Y, which is 30. And this is 40 plus 60, which is 100. And therefore, in the end, we agree that Obviously, Joseph counted 100 legs. And as a consequence, we have confirmed the correctness of the result, and we were able to, we were able to make uh, the following uh, inference. And we say, therefore, therefore, there are x equals 10 pigs. And y equals uh, 30, because we got y equals 30. So yeah, and y equals 30, okay? Y equals 30 chickens. And indeed, this here concludes the, the solution to the problem, 10 pigs and 30 chickens, and we're excited about this, and this is awesome news. Right, we must thank everybody for watching and goodbye to you.